I kind of find that moment, Christina, you're so nice, you're quite passive with your hands, which is very, very nice, but make sure that you don't allow her to push and to start to lean against the rain and not do something about her. If you ask her for haunches in, she doesn't necessarily want to come to that much together in her frame, doesn't want to yield that much, and she starts to pull against the contact, you have to do something about it. Maybe counterflex her a little bit. Get her loose through her right shoulder and right side of her neck. Right. And then back to haunches in again. So she never learns to brace against the aids when you put them on. If she does, you must do something about it. And then ask again. So the horses never learn, especially at a young age. They never learn to be heavy. They never learn to be strong. Right. And if she gives you the wrong answer, you do something about it. Good. <laughs> but just keep thinking when you um, feel like your right shoulder wants to be up a little bit, try to reorganize more in the central part of your muscles in your body, not just your shoulders. Think about your belly button, think about your sternum, think about opening your chest and closing your upper back line a little bit more so that you, when you feel your elbows drop into your hips, you know it's right. Right. And that for collecting a horse is ultimately important. That you can strengthen that circle in your body and strengthen that connection of your hip and elbow to create a feeling of your horse wanting to collect up underneath you. Yep. Good. And if she hits it and she hits this feeling, she comes right up. If she hits that and you pick up your hands or you hold a little bit, she'll end up just holding and pulling down against you in the shoulders. You want her to have the feeling that she wants to lift her withers in the half. But anytime they can change our position or pull us out or make us lift the hands and disconnect the elbows from the seat, they start to own the connection more and more and more. <laughs>